Angels hosting the White Sox. New hitting coach Jim Eppard for L.A. replacing Mickey Hatcher. Looking to help Albert Pujols and the Angels offense. Bottom second, Gavin Floyd making the start for Chicago. With a runner on and two outs, Eric Ibar. The RBI double off the wall and right. Vernon Wells scores from first to one nothing Angels lead. Top three, Jerome Williams on the mound for L.A. with one out. Dion Viciedo comes up with a solo home run into the Rocks in left center. Ties the ball game up at a run apiece. Later in the inning, a runner on with two outs. Gordon Beckham hits it to deep left. The RBI double, Alejandro Deaza comes in to score. Chicago leads 2-1. Bottom of the inning, Floyd battling Albert Pujols with two on and nobody out. 0-1 pitch, and he lifts that one in the air, and he hit it well into center field. It's out by the wall, out of here! A three-run homer by Pujols, his second of the season. And the Angels are back on top in this ball game. It's now 4-2. Call courtesy of KLAA. Bottom five, Floyd facing Mike Trout at the plate. He connects to left for the single as he tries to go to second on the play. But Viciedo fires it to second from left to get Trout out on a great play. In the sixth, LA up 5-2, Floyd again facing Wells. So here's Vernon Wells batting, and he hits one high and deep into left field. You can kiss it goodbye, out of here. Vernon Wells has just hit his sixth home run of the season, and the lead continues to grow here at the Big A. KLAA with the call, that would make it a 7-2 ball game as L.A. would win by that final with 12 hits on the day they replaced their hitting coach, Mickey Hatcher. Jerome Williams earns the win going eight innings, giving up two earned runs on 10 hits for his fourth win of the year. Albert Pujols won for four at the plate, including his three-run shot. Gavin Floyd, the loss, dropping his record to three and four, giving up seven earned runs on 10 hits in six innings.